Hello everybody, my name is Lina and today I'm going to be your personal coach because this is Boxerside. Since we're living in the 21st century, everybody wants to have the perfect body, but does a perfect body exist? Well, yes, and I'm going to show you how to get it. What am I doing? Color points! Don't you want to double chin? Do you want to have cheekbones? And do you want to have hip bones? Then you have to keep watching. The first thing you need to do is pick some books. Let's say four books. The best books are hardcovers with a lot of pages. So I picked Snow Like Ashes by Sarah Rush. The complete novels of Jane Austen. The Collected Works by Oscar Wilde and Clockwork Prince by Cassandra Clare. Let's begin! <laughs> we try to divide the weight. And you have to put the books above your head and get them back down and again above your head. And the books may not fall. It's harder than it seems because the books want to go to the ground <laughs> and they're actually quite heavy if you keep them like this the next thing is something you can do in a bookstore so you take some books to begin with then you take some other books like this let's say and you just like walk around a lot of times and these arms there will be so muscles. You can also lift these books, but not above your head because they will fall. <laughs> this is an exercise to practice how you pick up things without really hurting your back. So you put these books down and then you're gonna pick them up. But not like this, because it's not healthy for your back. You bend your knees. Try to pick him up and back. <laughs> it's even better than squats. So that's your exercises for your arms and legs. Now let's start with the exercises for the double chin. <laughs> well, first of all, you take some books. Let's say. The Hunger Games by Susan Collins, The Goddess Test by Amy Carter, and The Unbecoming of Mara Dyer by Michelle Hutkins. Put them like this between your chest and your chin. And you try to keep <laughs> and you try not to let them fall. But you have to use your chin. And I got it is actually really working, I guess. I feel the muscles in my neck. Yep, and you. A rule is you may not do like this. You have it stand just straight. Ish. You have to use your your neck and your chin, and then you can talk, and it's like really hard, and you feel like a muppet because your head is moving up instead of your chin that's going down, and you can do. A couple of exercises at the same time. I actually really think this won't work because my neck. <laughs> An exercise for your collarbones. I do this exercise every day and look at my collarbones. <laughs> so you take your books also, let's say the same weight, and you do like this. <sighs> And try only to use your shoulders. And if you're really a specialist, you can hug yourself. <laughs> and I can assure you, those color bones will come just as your mus your fingers will be very muscles. They will have muscles on top of muscles. Now we've had the exercise for our arms, our legs, or shoulder-ish area our neck and now we have to do you with the tummy the tummy so 
you take one book or more but let's just start with one book you place them just right next to you and you do a plank with a book on your back so now we've trained our arms our legs our stomach our shoulderish area our neck and if you really want to have these cheekbones then you just have to read books out loud so you will use them <laughs> you probably ask why is this video on a Sunday well I'm going on vacation and I can't post on vacation and I had a feeling that I hadn't post during July a lot and let's say half August I can I also can't post any videos so I thought I will do now a video and when I come home I will also do two videos so that will hopefully you will forgive me so that was it for today I hope you enjoyed watching because I honestly I really enjoyed making this video let me know in the comments below if you have other books size us <laughs> and let me also know if you want more of these videos because I actually really really enjoyed making them and I just want to say not everybody is the same and I literally mean not every space body is the same because there are people who are a little who look fatter who look thinner who look fitter and at the end of the day it really doesn't matter but <laughs> yeah I hope you enjoyed watching this so yeah see you next time bye